Hello students, welcome to my channel. This is Shantanu from RT Crafty. Today I will talk about four graphic prints of four Indian graphic artists. They are Somnath Kaur, Jyoti Bhatt, K. Lakshma Gaur, and Anupam Sud. So let's start. Some common terms in graphic art. A category of fine art, graphic art covers a broad range of visual artistic expression, typically two-dimensional, that is produced on a flat surface. The term usually refers to the arts that rely more on line or tone than on color, especially drawing and the various forms of engraving. It is sometimes understood to refer specifically to printmaking processes such as line engraving, aquatint, dry point, etching, mezzotint, monotype, lithography and screen printing. Graphics or printmaking is very popular form of art which are being used by Western artists for many centuries. Indian painters took interest in graphics from the end of 19th century AD. Etching, dry point, aqua tint, intaglio, lithography, oleograph, etc. are used by many Indian artists. The main advantage of printmaking is to produce number of copies of the same painting. Raja Ravi Verma could popularize his paintings by printing many copies of his works in oleograph technique. Krishna Reddy is one of the most famous printmakers of that time. Etching, a method of making prints from a metal plate, usually copper, into which the design have been incised by acid. The copper plate is first coated with an acid resistant substance called the etching ground through which the design is drawn with a sharp tool. The ground is usually a compound of B-wax, bitumen and resin. The plate is then exposed to nitric acid or Dutch mordant which eats away those areas of the plate unprotected by the ground, forming a pattern of recessed lines. These lines hold the ink and when the plate is applied to moist paper, the design transfer to the paper making a finished print. Aquatint is a variety of etching widely used by printmakers to achieve a broad range of tonal values. The process is called aquatint because finished prints often resemble watercolor drawings or wash drawings. Lithography, planographic printing process that makes use of the immiscibility of grease and water. In the lithographic process, ink is applied to a grease-treated image on the flat printing surface. Non-image, that is blank areas which hold moisture, repel the lithographic ink. This inked surface is then printed either directly on paper by means of a special press as in most fine art printmaking or onto a rubber cylinder as in commercial printing. Intaglio printing is the opposite of relief printing in that the printing is done from ink 
that is below the surface of the plate the design is cut scratched or etched into the printing surface of plate which can be copper zinc aluminum magnesium plastics or even coated paper the printing ink is rubbed into the incisions or grooves and the surface is wiped clean unlike surface printing intaglio printing which is actually a process of embossing the paper into the incised lines requires considerable pressure intaglio processes are probably the most versatile of the print making methods as various techniques can produce a wide range of effects the painting at the left side is aqua tint by anjani reddy and at the right there is an intaglio by k lakshma gold at the center there is a lithograph print by raja ravi verma children artist somnath hor it is done in 1958 ad period contemporary modern size is not known medium etching with aqua tint on copper plate subject matter or theme it is the visualization of the artist emotional response to the pain and suffering of the poor and deprived the wounded humanity description this graphic work has manifested the struggle and agony of a poor family preyed of starvation malnutrition and exploitation this composition is a powerful protest and the expression of the anguish the artist suffered it is a close knit composition of five standing figures all victims of starvation the etching shows three emaciated children with bloated stomachs and thin triangular rib cages large heads and small faces with protruding eyes their mother is standing behind them as if protecting them a girl is looking toward them probably mercifully this is the graphic print children by somnath hor devi artist jyoti bhat it is done in 1970 ad period contemporary modern size 22.5 into 18 inches medium etching technique on a brass surface subject matter it shows devi as a power of worship and the hidden power of kundalini description it depicts the idea of fertility and power worshiped as shakti or devi in the tantric cult this power lies as kundalini a serpent in the female form at the base of the spine both in male and female the artist envisages the form of kundalini encircling the female fertility power in the form of a young lady in the lower section of the print artist has slightly departed from the original concept of male power residing in the brain and has placed this power within the fold of the kundalini in the heart devi shakti this deviation 
from the tantric concept may have originated from the words pseudo tantric kundalini printed on the decorative pendant on the right of devi's head a brilliant red bindi beautifies the forehead of devi whose large eyes resemble the durga images of bengal this is the painting devi done by jyoti bhat of walls artist anupam sood it is done in 1982 ad period contemporary modern size 50 inches by 63 inches medium lithograph technique subject matter or theme this artwork is a journey of the artist down her memory lane of childhood This lithograph depicts a widow in traditional white clothes sitting in a pathetic countenance. A black face indicates that she has become a non-entity, part of legs laying before her, possibly of her dead husband with whose death she has also died for the society. On brick wall behind her are made pictures of live activities with white color that remind that there was a time when he also was a part of those activities this is the graphic work of walls done by anupam sood man woman and tree artist k lakshma gold it is done between 1980 to 90 ad period contemporary modern size not known medium etching and aqua tint on wove paper subject matter or theme the artist has presented a rustic version of a man woman and a tree description the painting shows a female figure centrally composed with a grove of trees and shrubs on her left and on her right a male figure under a grove merges with trees and the lower portion of his body is surrounded by a growth of shrubs the male and female figures are facing each other and there is a smile in the tree spirit's face the way the stems twigs and leaves of the upward three trees have been shown becoming embraced this is the graphic word man woman and tree done by k lakshma god Thanks for watching please like and subscribe and if there is any doubt or query please put a note in the comment box below see you in the next video bye